Go home, Mort. Your wife loved your son just as much as you did. You're not the only one who's suffering. You're gonna tell me about suffering? I've been listening to people suffering for 20 years. And I've made a damn good profit of- No, you don't. Let I am not gonna stand here and- Let go! I didn't say I had another patient today. Have a seat. Okay, let's uh, start with the basics. Your name, age, and uh, what school you go to. If, it, if that's uncomfortable for you, do you know why you're here? If you don't answer my questions, we're not gonna get very far. So, help me help you. Can you do that for me? Oh, I see you found Gustavo Gelato. Did you know he was the greatest dancer in all of Italy? Here, let me show you. Gustavo shined the streets of Italy with his jigs, taps, and hops, marveling the masses. He loved to dance. He would show off his dance from the top of the Alps to the Mediterranean Sea. And look at that, he even made friends everywhere he went. Oh, what adventures he had. He must have been really proud of it. Yes, yes he was. He had hoped that one day, his dance would be seen around the world. But that day didn't come. You see, the evil witch lived by the sea, had stolen his dance abilities, put them in a magic urn. Are you all right, sir? Yeah, yeah. Anyway, Gustavo searched high and low for the evil witch. And by the time he found her, she had already thrown the urn into the ocean, so Gustavo jumped into the ocean. Wait, he... wouldn't he rot? Look, staying in the water too long would rot him. Yes, but without his dance powers, he had nothing. So he was about to jump but... in. If Gustavo rots, all his friends would be sad, and the greatest dancer in Italy wouldn't exist. I think he couldn't have jumped into the sea, because he's right here. And what did Gustavo do? Well, it's obvious, right? The urn dropped to the bottom of the ocean and cracked. Gustavo's dance powers went into all the fishes that were swimming around. Is that why we have flying fish? Yes. Yes, that's exactly why we have flying fish. <laughs> uh, it's getting late. You need to be heading home. So should I. Let's get you another appointment. You know, I didn't even get your name. 